Angel Faces, it's your girl Bliss here. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm sharing how I set up my altar and a money spell. As always, any information or spells I share are not meant to be received as being the quote-unquote right way. I don't believe there is a quote-unquote right way to create a spell or conduct a ritual. There is only the way that feels right to the individual. My way may not be your way, and that's totally cool. If anything, the spells and rituals I share are intended for ideas and inspiration for your own spells. Alright, let's get on with the video. So I did this spell on a Thursday at 3pm using solar magic. First, I always set up my altar with a white candle, water I blessed myself, a stick of incense, an athame, and some salt to use in my opening ritual. I shared this ritual along with my closing ritual in a previous video that I've linked down below. I prepped this spell by painting a symbol I associate with financial abundance. Because of my background in Reiki, using symbols and spells and rituals really helps me get the magic flowing. Part of my craft is tapping into my creativity and love of painting. Like in Reiki, the symbol itself isn't what holds the power, it's the intention. When I paint, I infuse my intention into the symbol. Then, on a piece of paper, I write down what I intend to manifest. At least when it comes to money, I find manifesting it comes faster and easier when the amount feels attainable. Unless you're a master manifester and or highly successful in business, attempting to manifest a million dollars in a day just doesn't feel realistic to me. In this case, I felt a thousand dollars was reasonable. Next, I carve these symbols into a green candle. Then I anoint the candle with patchouli oil. In a small bowl, I combine allspice, chamomile, cloves, nutmeg, and marjoram? Marjoram? I think that's how you say it. To my altar, I add real money, plus my debit card, and a raw citrine quartz. Once my altar is all set up, I go into my opening ritual. As part of the opening ritual and this money spell, I call on the Angel of Manifestation to enter my sacred circle and to aid in my spell. It's at this point I start the spell first by lighting the green candle and then carefully sprinkling a bit of the herb mixture over the flame as I say. With this spell, I manifest a minimum of $1,000 of disposable income in my bank account this month and every month for the rest of my living days. May an abundance of money flow freely into my life. I ask that it come quickly, easily, and peacefully. I like to use affirmations in my spells as well. The affirmations I used for this one are by T. Harv Ecker. I create my life. I create the exact amount of my financial success. My intention is to create wealth and abundance. I believe money is important, money is freedom, and money makes life more enjoyable. I get rich doing what I love. I deserve to be rich because I add value to other people's lives. I am a generous giver and an excellent receiver. I am truly grateful for the money I have now. Lucrative opportunities always come my way. My capacity to earn, hold, and grow money expands day by day. Then I chant, quote unquote, I am abundant in all, until I intuitively feel it's time to stop. Next, I take time to visualize and journal as though I already have the money. For example, with this extra $1,000 in my bank account, I feel so free and relaxed and full of joy and gratitude. With this extra $1,000, I am taking my friends and family out for fun times. Finally, I finish the spell. Let this spell be spread into the air. Grant that nothing may my spell impair. Bring success and wealth to me. As this I spell, so mote it be. Then I release the angels, corners, and sacred circle. So that's all I have for you guys today. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.
Lesson B.